but the commitment is and we've been doing it since COVID-19. This government has continued to support the poor and vulnerable through a range of measures, through the Ministry of Social Development and Family Services, also through other ministries, ministry responsible for youth and so on, and other agencies as well. Uh, but at this stage, we realize that we have to try to assist, uh, especially with this very basic item, um, the Ministry of Finance, the rest of the government, the cabinet, we are reviewing what the policy possibilities are, but understanding the complexities in determining what's the right solution. It's very easy to say, okay, let's go to those who receive social development assistance, but that's a narrow net. That's a narrow net because many, many more households are in fact feeling the pinch with this increase in flour, which is a really basic item. You're right? So we are considering the government through the Ministry of Finance, is that we are actually considering the options to mitigate the impact on, on citizens. And in this regard, we really hope that we can report back to the population in under two weeks, or at least say something and commit something to you. It, however, it's an imperative on my part at this time to really make an appeal to the retailers, the shopkeepers, the supermarkets, groceries, bakers, corner stores, really to do their part as well and be reasonable.